Hey, I'm Spectre Ball. Consider subscribing, click on that notification bell to be alerted when a new video is available. And be sure to click on that like button to let YouTube know that we exist. Also, follow me on TikTok. Thank you so much. We just hit 6,000 subscribers. I truly appreciate your support for this channel. Now let's talk a little bit about Asmodeus, Asmode. King Asmodeus is the 32nd spirit of the 72 spirits of the Galatia. King Asmodeus makes men fly into passionate rage, destroys the happiness of married couples, wastes the beauty of virgins, and reveals the future. That is what is said about Asmodeus. When you are looking at the attributes of the infernal divine being, like Asmodeus, you have to take into consideration that there are other things that Asmodeus can do other than what is written. It is important when you are starting to work with Asmodeus that you ask what his attributes are. My experience with working with Asmodeus, he could break down old, boundaries that you created and build new ones. He can show you how to have a backbone. He could help you connect to the raw primal essence, a sexual essence, but at its core, not from a surface level, but from a deep down desire. That's what you have to pay attention to when working with Asmodeus. You have to look deeper when you are working with this beautiful king, not from a surface level. But that does take time. The more you work with the energy, the more your body will become accustomed to it. In working with Asmodeus, he will put you in a masculine frame, pure masculinity, not toxic but pure masculinity. When working with Asmodeus, you have to be aware of what is going on. That's why it's important to develop your psychic abilities so you could really understand what the energy is trying to show you. Lilith is Asmodeus' consort. Lilith only trusts Asmodeus where she could feel more in her feminine. She trusts him so much that she is not as dominant around Asmodeus. Things that I've understood that Asmodeus does not like. Asmodeus does not like to be ignored. If Asmodeus is trying to contact you, do not ignore him. If Asmodeus is approaching you, allow it to happen. Asmodeus is a wonderful teacher, could teach many things, especially when it comes to standing up for yourself, growing yourself to be stronger and have a very strong backbone. Asmodeus is wonderful at teaching this. When I work with Asmodeus, I work with Asmodeus in his sphere, Galakab which is a sphere of the Klippoth. I do feel that when working with Asmodeus separately from the sphere of the Klippoth, it might be a bit different. I do recommend evoking Asmodeus before invoking him, because invoking Asmodeus is going to be intense compared to evoking Asmodeus. The difference between evoking and invoking when you are evoking a spirit, you are bringing it forth so you may speak to it as if a person is standing in front of you. When you are invoking, their energy penetrates into you and you want to have some sort of relationship, some sort of trust before doing anything like this so that everything could be in harmony when you are working with the spirit. Anyway, thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video.